Hello, everybody. This is Shaleen, the Color in Book Nook. It is Thursday Live. We are Diamond Painting. Who has joined me? Diamond Painting. So who is all here? Hi, Palmy. Hi, Mystical. Hi, Silver. Hi, Deborah. Well, it's Crystal and Robert. How are you guys today? I am seeing what other have a piece of trash. Where's my other tweezers? <laughs> Hi, hi, hi. Oh, nope, you can't be up here. I'm diamond painting, not coloring. Sorry, Miss Pearly Girl. Down you go. <clears throat> Did everybody have a good day? Are you feeling down because of the weather like I am? It's been gray out. I need some sunshine. Where is that sunshine? Okay, Ms. Red Stiletto's Crafts and Shoes Closet. Well, I'm going to call you Red. Is that okay? Hi, Daniel. Hi, Catherine. They don't honor their own coupon anymore. How can they not honor their own coupon? They have to honor their own coupons. I don't understand. So, yeah, I need I need something to change in my life. I'm telling you. <laughs> really, Crystal? <laughs> Most call you Ms. Red. Okay. Yep, different areas. Yeah, but if they already had a coupon, how can they not honor the ones that they already had? If they have if they don't if they don't have an expiration date and the expiration date's not up. You know, they're going to start losing business if they're not going to do any more coupons and they don't honor the ones that they still have. If it has an expiration date and it's not that date yet, I don't think that that's right. They'll be losing customers. So, Crystal, yes. Um, Joanne and Michaels have coupons. Yes, Joanne and Michaels still has coupons. Silver got two more cross stitch kits today. Okay, Elizabeth. Well, stay safe. What have you been reading lately? I'm going, I'm just going through some funky phase. I think I need change again. I like change. And sometimes I need it in my life to revamp my life, I guess. And right now I am like, really, I really want to move. And we can't, but I really want to. <laughs> Uh, I'm just, yeah. So, sorry, I was talking to Crystal, too. So, yeah, different areas of New York State talk different. New York City is way different than here by Buffalo. We say things different. And all kinds. Hi, Danielle. 
Yeah, Catherine, I would have argued with the manager too. Now, Catherine, what you need to do is go to corporate and send an email or something. So, I'm sorry about that, Mystical. I have never been told that. Thank you. This is from Enablers Outpost. It's called Rachel's Galaxy, and it's purple, and it's got gold flakes all through it. I did get a new one in the other day from Bistro Blanks. She has a Facebook group. I wanted an Easter one, so I have this. It has a little purple chick in it that's a little fluffy chick. You can see the legs and the feet and the beak. And then nestled in here are some eggs from, like, the chick. Then you got some wood and wood up here. So I'm going to use this next month in the family room. Hi, Laverne. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm just I'm just in that funky mood I got in, and I know it's from I'm just I feel like crap today. <laughs> I really do. You ever just have one of those days? Well, mine have been coming along more than normal. And I'm taking my vitamin D. I'm taking my regular multivitamin. You know, I'm taking all my medicine. I, I think it's just the weather. And I need to get away. I need a vacation. That's And I told it to my husband. I said, I have been cooped up in this house for a year because of the pandemic and it's not all the pandemic. It's also me with my anxiety and just, you know, things like that. Um, I used to go to Myrtle Beach every year in October for the cross-stitch retreat. I did that for like 20 years and I only missed like three or four of them. And I haven't been there since, what was the last one, 2018? 2017 or 2018 was the last one. And yeah, I'm having these withdrawals that I need to be by the water. I would love to live by the water again. Okay. Elizabeth's coming down with a cold. I'm not coming down with a cold. I'm just today I'm just hurting. I didn't I didn't do anything. I sit here and I'm not lying. I diamond painted all day and I'm listening to an audio book. I have like an hour left. Well, it's a book from that galley, but I'm doing text to speech. So I've been listening to that all day and diamond painting. That's it. That's all I did today. I have no energy. Didn't do dishes. Didn't clean the family room. I did watch. Was it yet? I did watch yesterday's General Hospital and today's. And tonight I will watch Station 19 and Grey's Anatomy. I will finish my book and then I'm going to watch some more of the playlist. So I think I just need to be around friends.
Yeah, I just, I need to get out. I, you know, Justin and before the Corona, Justin and I were talking about renting a place at the Thousand Islands for a week. And just him and I going. Because Scott never takes vacations. He drives me up the wall. So Justin and I were going to go. Justin is my oldest son. He is 30. He will be 31 this month. And we were just going to go rent a place. Just the two of us. For a week. And we kept putting it off. Oh, we kept putting it off because Scott had gotten laid off. Then the pandemic hit. So I really, really need that vacation. But Scott will be losing his job this month. And so we don't know what the future holds. So I really can't make reservations anywhere with Justin till I know what's going on. It's just been one thing after another. <laughs> Okay, welcome. I know, Crystal. No, you have an accent. We all have an accent to other people. It's not just one person. Everybody has an accent to where other people live. So to me, Crystal, I don't even notice Crystal's accent. As much as I do some others from the South. But, yeah. Everybody has an accent to other people. We all say things different than other people, which makes the world go round. Because I say pop. A lot of us say pop here. A lot of other people say um, soda. And neither one is wrong. It's just where we are raised. I also cannot stand sweet tea. I am a northerner. We grew up drinking unsweetened tea. Now, all of a sudden, sweet tea is all over because this country has all... <sighs> That's why a lot of people are diabetic now because <laughs> they're all drinking all the sweet tea. <laughs> Hi, Grace. How are you? Yes, this is Rachel's Galaxy from Enablers Outpost. Danielle says she has a deep south accent. Hi, Robin. So, yeah, I mean, I have friends who say pocketbooks instead of purse. I say purse. Um... To me, a buggy is something that you push a baby in, like with, which is a stroller. But I have friends, I have some that live in the Carolinas who call a buggy a shopping cart. They call a shopping cart a buggy. And I'm like, no, that's a shopping cart. I have a friend who tells me she's going to the market when we say we're going grocery shopping. So it's everything is so different all over. And I think it's pretty neat that. You know, I like learning new things, but I have a few friends who will tell me that I'm wrong and it's not wrong. It's just because of the culture and where you live. <laughs> See, Crystal, once I get to the retreat, I won't have the anxiety. I will only have it on the way to the retreat. And the only way I will get it at the retreat is because of eating, because a lot of foods, I I can't say a lot of foods. I don't know what foods will trigger my IBS because like, like say today I eat a couple pieces of pizza, for example, it won't bother me. But the next time I eat it, like maybe a week later, it'll bother me. You call them bubbles. You do not call them shopping cart. You call them bubbies. 
No, not bubbies, buggies. G, B U G G Y, buggy. We call them shopping carts. You know, and we call purses, purses, and other people call them pocketbooks. There's just so many different things that are different. And it's not wrong. It's just different cultures. So, yes, Crystal, I would love to go to the retreat. I know what retreats are like because I've gone to the one in Myrtle Beach for many, many years. Your neighbor across the street calls you the Yankee. Yeah, I don't like, I don't like, I don't call the people that live down south Southerners. I don't like being called a Yankee that because the people that call us that are not saying it in a nice way. I've already found that out that when you're down north, because I've been in Myrtle Beach many times to them. It is not a um, nice word. <laughs> so, yeah. I um, One of my friends that lives down south, her husband made a nasty comment about Yankees, and he didn't realize where I lived, and she got mad at him. I don't say use guys. I say, hey, you guys. I don't say use. Use guys? I've never said that. Grace sent me her Chuck Pinson she's working on. Let's see if I can get this without that ring, a light. Ah, here. Her Chuck Pinson she's working on. Yeah, I've never said use guys. I'll say, hey, you guys. Laverne said she will never adjust. <clears throat> Does it really make a big difference with that light? I can turn it off if it doesn't make any difference. Oh, uh, maybe it does. I'll just have to move it when I show pictures. <laughs> Grace is having a wax and a tray addiction. This tray, hold on, I'll tell you, I got my business cards here. I love this tray. I want more. Um, Hold on. This one is from JH Envision Lab. They are on, um, it's an Etsy shop. JH Envision Lab. Hi, Leo. Happy St. Patrick's Day, a day late. I love this tray. I have another tray from 3D Designs. That's rectangle. I like the square better. I would like this in like a white or a lighter color. So when I have the dark colors on here, it's hard to see. Elizabeth said her sister got her this. Hold on. Oh, she got her the mermaid special. The Color in Heaven Mermaid Special. I have so many mermaids books. I didn't get that one. And then there was another one, I think, with dragons. I have enough dragon stuff. Then there was a fairy one. But I have enough fairy stuff. Hi, Ureli. How are you? Thank you, Christy. So Christy just put up the link for the JH Envision Lab. 
So, well, Grace, you missed. I, I did get a new pen. This is from Bistro Blanks. It's got a little purple chick in here. There's her little feet. And then down here is some eggs. See, now, I, I think this one's a square. And this is the new squares. And, oh, my gosh, I will tell you what. What a huge difference in the new squares that they're using with TSA. Because that last one I did, that Cheshire Cat, was an absolute nightmare. This is almost half done. I don't have one popping drill. They click into place really nice. I hardly have, look at this is all I have of trash so far. My other one is like a quarter filled from the Cheshire Cat. And I didn't even put them all in. So, yeah. Yep, Yareli, don't be afraid. Now, if you like squares, don't be afraid to order now from TSA the squares because... The last two that I had were from last year's batch of squares, and I hated them. I had issues with both of them, so I stopped ordering squares from TSA. I was only getting the rounds. And then for Christmas, my friend Lisa Gadsbury bought me two TSAs that are square because she didn't know. She's not a diamond paint painter, so she didn't know. So I was dreading starting this, and... I'll tell you, and I already, I already um, emailed um, Rachel from TSA to let her know, and she said to thank you for the feedback because I let her know. Oh my God, this is a dream to work on. These are as nice as my Ever Moments. So if you have done Ever Moment squares, these are about as nice as those. I still like my Ever Moment squares. Okay, so Grace got a new pen. That's pretty. Corby Bender. I haven't heard of that brand. And then this, yeah. So this... One's from Pashi Pens. So this one's from Pashi Pens. Won't let me enlarge it. And then Corby Bender. That one's pretty. Hi, Caroline. How are you? Oh, Grace, ever moment. I just wish they wouldn't steal images. That's my only gripe with ever moment because they're from, um, not Etsy. What is it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> So, yeah, Ever Moment is amazing. AliExpress. So, thank you, Urelli. <laughs> I, as I looked over, it popped in my head. So, yeah, Ever Moments from AliExpress. Their canvases and their drills are amazing. But they have stolen images. This is what Robin's working on. Oh, I like that. That is pretty. Hi, Diamond Lady. Okay, going to be working and working, making dinner. What's for dinner? So any of you that do squares, have are you able to multi-place with the squares? 
I don't because I find that um, my squares don't go on straight and I got to correct them. And so it's a waste of time for me. If I got to sit there and correct them all, it's a waste of time. Oh, this tree, this organizer here is from um, Bella De Nicole. I love this for the bags from Treasure Studios Art. I don't put the, I just work out of the bags. And so I have them in here. So like 100 is here, but I have a big bag of 310. So that's with that. Then the 300s, then the 400s, and there's only one 500. And then my 800s, my... 900s, 3000s, and 3300s. So I have them in the tray like this. I love this organizer. Oh my gosh. And you could put labels on it if you want. It has like the little index tab. But it took me a while to get this. Robin does 15 and 20 multi placers. What? I don't believe that one, Robin. <laughs> <laughs> I and I have a hard time with believing that they're on straight. <laughs> I'm not calling you a liar. I'm just saying I have a hard time believing that. I can multi-place with the rounds, no problem, and I don't have to fix them. But the squares are never straight. I've tried it. I don't like, you know, I'm always, I always have to fix them and straighten them. And it's like they look straight on my placer. When I put it on the placer, I'll look and they're on straight, but they don't go on straight on the canvas. <laughs> So did anybody purchase any of the pre-orders from Craftably? I like that it's opened for a couple of weeks and that they will not be sold out. That is what is in this pen is micro glue dot. Hi, Marilyn. Thank you for coming in. Everybody, we have a new person here, Marilyn. But somebody else, I think, was new also. Yeah, I got all four of Sheena Pikes, and then I got two of... Well, see, the I was able to get Chloe the Crazy Cat Lady because I wasn't able to get that before. So I was able to get it this time around. So I ordered that. And I ordered two of the Jasmine Beckett Griffiths. Grace, you don't have to use capital letters. Let's see, I got, yeah, so I, hold on, that's not it, craftably, where are you? Why can't I find my craftably order? Well, that's really weird. 
Oh, right there. So, yeah, I ordered Puppy Craze Petunia, Java Joanna, Bunny Loving Bethany, Faces of Fairy 177, Cat Crazy Chloe, and Darling Dragonling 4. You have a lot of old, yeah, I have some that of the first DAC ones that I bought. So I was surprised I was able to get some new ones. Elizabeth's busy reading. Oh, no, Ms. Red. Well, Grace, if you want any more Mandy's, you better order them because they cannot be making them any more of the princesses. Anything by Mandy that has to do with Disney, they can no longer do. Debra is diamond painting. What are you diamond painting, Debra? <clears throat> also, Sherry Baldy broke the contract with Diamond Art Club because she wasn't supposed to. She was supposed to be a guest exclusive. And she started selling them on her own website. So um, they won't be carrying any more of Sherry Baldy. But, yep, Disney said Mandy's look too much like the Disney princesses, so she can no longer do them. It's okay, Silver. I almost didn't stream because of the mood I've been in, too. Oh, Deborah's working on Crystal Lake Cabin by Dominic Davison. Yeah, Grace, my Chuck Pinson that I finished is um, up above a couch, and it is huge, but it looks really nice. And I do have two more Chuck Pinsons. But I'm not going to do them for a while. So I, this one, um, this is for the Disney one. There's two Disney diamond paint in the lawns. So I'm doing this. And my Ala salon ends the end of this month. And then in April, I'm starting a, I'd still have to make a video. I'm going to be doing a Randall Spangler diamond paint in the lawn. And I can't remember, I can't remember the hashtag. And I don't have my notebook in front of me. I moved things off this table because I, this table was a mess. So I moved everything. I got everything organized in here. So my notebook that I write all my hashtags are on a shelf. They're not right next to me. 
But yeah, I'm going to do a Randall Spangler lawn. I think it's hashtag Spring Spangler 2021. And it's for two months. It's April th through to the end of May. And then I don't have another one for this year, except um, I'm going to be doing one with Sherry from Purple Door Crafts. She wants to do a Halloween mystery diamond painting with me. So I have to get a hold of her, see if we're still doing that. And as far as color alarms on this channel, I'm done after this Alice. And the only one I will have again this year will be Carla Ween in um, October. Hold on, I'm missing something. Nana's in here. Did I miss someone? Hi, Brian. How are you? So, yeah, Mandy was told from Disney she can't do them anymore. So, there's a change in all of that. <laughs> they said that they look too much like the Disney princesses. So, she can't do them anymore. I know, Christy. Who doesn't have a Spangler? You need to go grab a Spangler. Oh, yeah, the UK is, the shipping is bad for you guys. Shipping is bad. Unfortunately. So how is Brian doing? What are you working on? So Grace, the micro mini dots. This is, well, I, I usually change it every month, but you don't have to. What's a sad panda? Why are you sad? What? What? Why are you sad? Hi, Rachel. Welcome. So, what diamond paintings do you have, Rachel? You're crocheting a lap link blanket. So Crystal doesn't have a Spangler. Oh, go hurry up and grab a Spangler so you can do the Spangler lawn. I am going to be doing afternoon tea. It is one that Robin and Frashan bought me. And then, I, that, so I will be starting that April 1st. Plus, I'm starting the mystery diamond painting that Craft and Journey is doing on her Facebook group. So, I got partnered up with someone who does not have a YouTube channel, but we message back and forth a lot on Facebook Messenger. We've gotten to know each other a little bit, and we're, we're excited. Rachel has a unicorn. Um, 
I know, Brian. That's because Disney said no. He gives me an Amazon who's not doing. Okay, Brian. So, yeah, I love this tray better than my 3D designs. I like it. They line up a lot better in this square than in my triangle, in my rectangle one. Either that or these squares are better than the squares I just got done using. No, Rachel, this is from Treasure Studios Art. It's um, Maleficent. I don't have a custom one yet. Only me and Nana have Spanglers, huh? <laughs> See, Robin's going to be doing one, too. I'm sure there's others that have Spanglers. They're just not in here. And I'm sick. And I used to put these in um, my Harbor Freights, but now that I have this, I um, I work out of the bags. And it's they're really nice to work out of the bags. And I don't have to kit up or kit down. Ms. Red says she has several Spanglers. Urelli has one. There's Nana. <laughs> she has many Spanglers. See, I will be doing a Spangler along starting April 1st for two months through the end of May. It'll be fun. I kind of want the one from Halloween. Those two dragons are adorable. See, there's quite a few of us that have Spanglers. And I've seen um, the sneak peeks for this week's releases from Diamond Art Club and I haven't seen anything that it says buy me. Anybody else see anything that they want? Oh, I got some more. See, that's not what I want. Oh, Yureli sent a photo. Hold on. Sorry, Yureli. I never heard my phone go off for it. Oh, I want this. Oh, they're all uh, it's autumn and a cat. I want that. Where did you get that? Oh, Distracted by Diamonds. I can never see anything from Distracted by Diamonds whenever I go on. That is so pretty. I want that. Oh, oh it's a black cat. And pumpkins. That is so me. 
my favorite diamond painting the fa my favorite one that i have done and it's hanging up is um jessica rabbit okay so these are the three there i don't know if there's three or four but these are the new releases by diamond art club so we have some flowers with butterflies which i love butterflies but i don't want that then we have that one which nah it's okay and we have sloths which no now my daughter-in-law would love that because she loves sloths and then that's it for this week so far I, nothing i don't want any of them and this is mystical right that's what she's working on yep her crystal pony nope ms red said nope nothing from dac this month this week either yeah nothing's yelling to me no, I don't, I've never done a crystal canvas. I have enough. I am not joining any more groups. <laughs> I'm not joining anymore. I can't keep up with the groups I'm in. I don't post in them. I, I, yeah. Well, there you go, crystal pre-order one. I don't know what to tell you. And I don't know how long it's going to take when you pre-order. I got a couple of these bags mixed up. So I figured from craftably, I want the Sheena Pike and Jasmine Beckett Griffith whenever she has new ones. And from Diamond Art Club, we'll have to see if Mandy Manzano is going to be doing anything else and is no longer the princesses, but I'm sure she's going to be doing something else, hopefully. And then... Um, I'll just get probably Randall Spangler. I don't know. I don't need anything else. That's the thing. <laughs> oh, end of May. You'll wait. Yeah. Now I've got to fill in some that I missed. Okay, it's now, I'm just going to start doing this earlier because some people leave. But it's food o'clock. What are you having for dinner? What did you have for dinner? I'm not hungry. I didn't take anything out of the freezer. I picked it, the leftovers of the um, corned beef from yesterday. And I don't know, just... I don't feel like eating. I don't feel sick. I just don't feel like eating. <laughs> yes, I have one from Dreamer Designs. It's a Chuck Pinson. I think it's the only one I have from Dreamer Designs. I don't think I have another one. You're having pork chops. I don't know what I'm going to have.
Mystical's having a sub. Yorelli's thinking of making hard shell tacos. Laverne is having leftover corned beef. Robin's having pulled pork, egg noodles, veggies, and biscuits. Grace, Pearl is not allowed up here when I diamond paint. She already tried getting up here. But I don't let her up here when I'm diamond painting because of her cat fur. Danielle's having salad. Diamond Lady says all done. Chicken stir fry with cauliflower rice. Mmm, that sounds good. I do that a lot. I I fix a lot of shrimp stir fry. I feel one raised. No, well, it's not really. Every once in a while I'll see if there's one raised. It's not so much that they popped. I might not have put it down. Right? Okay, so that small section's done. Uh, Mystical says it's grilled chicken roasted peppers with mozzarella. Mmm. Oh, uh, I'm sorry, Ms. Red. Deborah says a bacon cheeseburger from Burger King. Silver says I had scotch egg chips and baked beans with onion rings. What is scotch egg? I don't know what that is. A scotch egg? We learn new things in here. We like hearing about these other foods. And I have decided I really like putting washi tape on the plastic instead of using the um, parchment papers. But I can't use the cheap washi tape because the cheap washi tape does not stick to the plastic, which is this green one here. It kept, it's kept peeling off. It won't stick. So I had some, I think this is from Simply Gilded washi tape. And I laid it over the top to keep it down. But, yep. Two from Dreamer Designs. One from Mystical Diamond. One from Crystal Art. Three from TSA. Oh, my gosh, Grace. Yeah, I try to buy at least two from each company to try them out. I did find that I did not care for DIY Moon Shop. I think that... Their pr prices are a little high, and they don't have much color to their pictures. Now I got the hiccups, you guys. I'm sorry. Hold on, somebody wants to send me a message. I don't know who this person is. Lise. Oh, Lise Bell. On her channel is going to be doing an interview with Randall Spangler the end of May. Lise's Crafty Creations. See, that's one thing you won't find me doing because 
I I'm not good at doing interviews. I would not know what to ask for questions. I thought you were in a color in slump, Christy. Now you're in a diamond painting slump. Oh, you're welcome, Mr. Cole. It was fun. So every Wednesday at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I have a Zoom chat. And we just do crafts. You can do whatever craft you want. There might be a couple of times where I might do tutorials because they worked. And um, some people have asked me to do tutorials. But otherwise, we just sit there and work on whatever we're working and chat. So yesterday was the first one. We had a really good time. And it was a little over two hours. <laughs> What's a Zoom call? Zoom is a it's like it's a chat room. Only we can either see your face or what you are working on. So you have to have the Zoom app or download the Zoom on your um, laptop or whatever. So we had a small issue. Everybody was having troubles using the link I gave them. So while I was in Zoom, I sent I sent them invites through Zoom, and then they were able to come in. And who was all there? So we had Mystical. We had um, Crystal. I didn't send to Christy because Christy, I. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll look up in a second. Um, I didn't send Christy an invite because I think your boyfriend's home and he's been gone for a while. Okay, scotch egg is a hard-boiled egg with sausage meat wrapped around it. You dip it in whipped up egg and cover it in breadcrumbs. Oh, that sounds really good. I have never heard of that. Wow. Remind you about what, Robin? Yep, Sarah was in there. Sarah was a blast. Crystal, Sarah, Mystical, Danielle was in there. Who else was in there? Was that it? I'm trying to remember. Oh, Robin, it's okay. I figured you weren't feeling well. I know if um, a couple people had appointments. Yep, autistic perspective. That's who was in there. Yep, she was in there. We had a good time. I know it's hard for people that have jobs and they're working. They can't come in. But the diamond painting community, it seems like there's so many that have live streams in the evening. So I couldn't do it in the evening. So I, I'm, and there's a lot of people on the East Coast, or I'm in the West Coast. So they're three hours behind me. So I had to pick a time. You know, so it's 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yeah, and not just a face. 
we also could hear their voices. No, I don't have a Facebook group for my diamond painting. I do have a Facebook group, though, that you can include your diamond painting, but it's not exclusively diamond painting. I started it out as a coloring group, but I allow any craft in there. There's the diamond lady. Yeah, Silver. Are you in the UK, Silver, right? You're six hours ahead of me or five? Okay, Rachel. Who's coming in? Yeah, so silver. Okay, diamond lady. That'll be cool. Thank you, Christy. Yeah, Grace, Mrs. Coffee cracks me up, too. She is such a great storyteller. I used to be, but I have to be careful what I say on here. Unfortunately, Robin knows why. <laughs> So I never know what to talk about. Okay, Mystical. So, Diamond Lady, you're on Facebook Messenger, right? So I can send you the link to the Zoom. I will. I I think that the best thing would be if people just sent me their email address and I can send one, one invite and it would go to everybody and I wouldn't have to do them all separate because I was sending so many separate messenger, um, Facebook messenger and Instagram messenger that if I had it all in one email group, I could just send it that way. Yeah, I think email would be good too. So I think if you want in on the Zoom chat from now on, I can send a bulk email. That would be easier. So my email is in my um, description below. So if you just want to send me an email and put in the title Zoom chat, I can add you. So I think I want to do it that way from now on. Thank you. 
And again, you don't have to be diamond painting. You can do anything you want. Um, Danielle was cross stitching. Um, you can color. You can diamond paint. You can crochet. Whatever you want to do that day. It's up to you. What time is it here? Right now it's 6.05 p.m. Okay, thanks, Diamond Lady. Because we just had a time change, Silver. I don't know why your bill would be so big. I don't understand what you mean, Grace, by bill. What you had to pay out in taxes? Is that what you mean? What you had to pay out? Okay, so at the moment you're four hours ahead. So it would be 5 p.m. for you. But are you guys, do you guys um, change your time at all? Also, if you ever want to know, no, you're four hours ahead. So one and four is five. So five o'clock your time. Oh, okay. Yep. You change your time. Oh, see, Grace, when Scott got unemployment for almost six months, he had enough taxes taken out that we didn't owe any this year. Well, we never owe any. But he made sure that he had taxes taken out of his unemployment. And now they're saying everybody's going to get that back. That we shouldn't have been taken that because of the what went on so i don't know we will see if we get that money back and he's got to sign up for unemployment again in a couple weeks hopefully it won't be for long Hi, Rose. We did our taxes already, and we already got ours back. Yeah, we did our taxes like the middle of February. We've already got them back. How is Rose today? Diamond Lady says doing their taxes tomorrow. And we got our... Um, what do you call it? You know, what Biden gave us. I get, We already got that, too. We got that. That one in, that went through yesterday. I'm, like, drawing a blink today. I've got brain fog. <laughs> I do. It's horrible. Yeah, there you go. Stimulus check. Oh, my gosh. I was just drawing a blank. 
Yep, the stimulus check, we got that yesterday. It showed it when I went on our bank and on Sunday, it showed it, but it said it wasn't available until Wednesday. Like, okay, so I went on this morning and looked and it is there. So that was nice. Oh, I got my Mickey Mouse stickers yesterday or today. Today? I don't remember. I'm losing track of time. <laughs> See, that's not right, Deborah. Okay, mystical. Bye. That's not right, Deborah. To make you file to get that. So is it worth filing to get that fourteen hundred? So I guess that's the other question. Is it worth filing to get that? Because then you got to pay a tax person to do it for you unless you know how. Robin says filed a couple of days ago to get hours. Not sure what will happen. Oh, Christy says she's on disability and she didn't have to file. It is weird. That is weird. So is everybody else getting the dreary looking weather too? I need to get away. <laughs> I want to meet up with some friends and hang out and craft. For like a whole weekend. Somewhere's close. No, Rose, my weather did not get sunny. It is dreary out today. It rained. It's very gray out. It did not make my mood any better. And I have no energy. It just zapped the life out of me. <laughs> Man, this has come to Alabama. Yeah. That's not close to me. Getting together doesn't cause me the anxiety. It's the traveling. Hmm. 
I never used to. This is something new for me that just started a couple years ago. I used to travel all the time. I used to drive to Pennsylvania to six hours away. Never bothered me. You know, I've always ridden in a car with friends to Myrtle Beach every year. That's never bothered me. And the last time I did go to Myrtle Beach was the first time it bothered me traveling and just going to shopping or anything around just in this area bothers me. But um, once I get to where I need to go, I'm fine. Being around my friends, I'm fine. I am in Western New York by Buffalo. Diamond Lady said yesterday was nasty outside. So, yeah, Deborah is like 40 minutes away from me. So, once this whole business with the virus is better, I want to meet up with Deborah. You know, like a Tim Hortons or something. I love Tim Hortons, and I haven't been in a Tim Hortons in a while. <clears throat> I have not seen Kathy in since last year, February or. Kim. Kim doesn't come in here anymore. And Catherine, I haven't heard from since January. I've messaged her. Don't hear back from her. And um, I, so I haven't seen her in over a year. She used to come here a couple times a year. And <coughs> she lives in um, on Long Island. And her parents live not too far from me so when she's here visiting her parents her and i would always get together for a day or two so i haven't seen her either <coughs> i forgot i had a cup of tea and it's cold now It's lukewarm. Oh, well. <clears throat> I need like one of those mug warmers to keep next to me to keep my tea warm because I forget I have it. You're getting your COVID shot. Oh, see, that's where I would have to go to is Henrietta at the Dome. I'm like, I don't want to drive all the way to the Dome. I mean, it's not, it's like half an hour away, but... I don't understand why each county doesn't have a place to go to. <coughs> and you have to be over 60, so I can't get it anyways. Oh, no, Silver. <laughs> Robin had her first COVID vaccine this afternoon. can hear the birds out there singing they better not be singing for more rain that's all i have to say i don't want gray sky so it can rain when it's sun shining out just bring out that sunshine it's rained before when the sun is out I want to see some flowers. Oh, no, Ms. Red, you have cancer. 
Okay. Oh my. <laughs> but see, it's sunny, so I could handle this. So this is where Rose lives. Rose lives in Alaska. See, I don't mind the snow and the cold as long as it's sunny out. And I can tell that it's sunny out. So see, that wouldn't bother me. See, that's what I thought too, Deborah, because I have asthma. So I was told I'd be able to get the shot. But then other people are saying, no, you can't. You have to be at least 60. Well, that's okay. I like your decorations. Well, I'm sorry that you've been fighting the cancer for three years now. I hope that they can get it taken care of and it goes away. <clears throat> nope. I love the snow. I don't mind it. I just want a sunny day. I need the sun. And last night I slept. I was going to go in Tia's live stream because she said she was going live. But when I looked this morning, there was no video up. And um, I ended up going to bed at 10 o'clock last night. I could not stay awake anymore. I usually don't go to bed till like midnight, 1 o'clock. I went to bed at 10. And I woke up at 5, went to the bathroom, let the dog out, went back to bed and slept till like quarter to 9, quarter after 9. <clears throat> so I must have needed the sleep. And then I was hurting all day. The Tylenol did help. But I have no energy. So I know it's the weather. Nope, don't let it beat you. Oh, okay, Deborah. She did go live, but it didn't show a video to rewatch. I'll have to look again. <clears throat> Not that I have time to rewatch. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so here's Rose's driveway with all the snow. <laughs> See now I would love that because it's it's a it's a bright day out there. I could handle that. Look at that huge snowbank to jump into. Oh, no. Hold on. I just got something. It has been confirmed that my husband's last day on his job is Sunday. <clears throat> Sunday is his last day, last day. So pray for us that he gets a job right away. He does not like sitting around the house. So hopefully there is one place he wants to get into really, really bad. He was told that they are hiring everybody that comes out of the place where he works now. He also had a job interview at another place. Um, they do want him. 
but they don't pay enough except for a different department would be paying the same amount. And so um, he was told to call them when he's done with this job. So bye, Robin. Thank you, guys. Sunny means negative 20 at night. Really? Oh, so it hasn't been sunny for the last couple of weeks. See, I need the sunshine. So, yep, the stimulus check came in at a good time, and um, I the only thing that I will be getting in the mail is my Coco Daisy, because I told them I'm not canceling that. <laughs> That's my one thing, I'm not canceling, and um, he just bought me those six pre-ordered those six craftably so i'm good i do have two coloring books that were pre-ordered already so i'm good on my coloring stuff i do get paid from youtube this month and i am buying the full set what was i getting Um, what was the set of pencils I was, was it the Koinor Polycolors? Because they have more now. I think that's what I was going to order. So I will be ordering those with my YouTube money because I told him my YouTube money goes back into my channel and I buy supplies to show you guys. <clears throat> so, yeah, and I usually get paid, what, the 21st, I think, from YouTube. Because I keep track of when I get paid and how much I make. At the at the first of each month, I check. So, like, March 1st, I checked February. So, I know between January's and February's, I will be getting paid. And then I'm going to order that set of pencils. Otherwise, I'm good. The only other coloring books I would really like is the um, mythographics. I have a couple, but I want the rest. So I will wait on that. If maybe with the next YouTube, I can do that. Or when I get paid from everybody for the cross-stitch charts and, no. So what's happened with the cross-stitch charts? They're still sitting in the bins. You want to know why? Because it seems like every time I want to go and do that, either something comes up and I get pulled away from it, or I'm having days like today where I have no energy and don't want to do anything. So the next time I have a good day, I'm hoping this only lasts today and I'm better tomorrow. So that I can get everybody's stuff and mailed out. I have Dawn's Kindle sitting here. I finally got a box for that. I just have to get it taped up. And Scott said he'll mail it for me. Oh, no, Danielle, it's fine. Yep, it'll work out, Rose. It'll work out. It always does. That He's been more stressed out than I have been. And I did try to get disability, but 
the state of New York is, I don't know about other places, but they are a pain in the ass and told me that I'm too young. And there's no reason why I can't have some kind of a job and work a few hours and I'm like um, I have anxiety I have asthma I have a lot of other issues and with the anxiety I told them it triggers IBS and if I don't if I'm not next to a bathroom I'm not going to make it to the bathroom on time and they don't seem to think that that's an issue well they can kiss my ass I'm sorry but them pencil pushers at work at the disability office have no freaking clue. <laughs> uh, so my husband said, just forget it. Because I said, well, I can get a disability lawyer. And he's like, nope, just forget it. They want to think that way, let them. My nephew is in his 30s. He has constant back pain. He cannot work. And he's been trying to get disability. And they told him the same thing that he's too young. He can't get it because he's too young. <clears throat> oh, see, Rose, I would love it where you are. You're so close to the water. I want to be by water. I grew up on a lake when, as a teenager, and I miss it. My husband didn't, and so to him, he doesn't get it. He doesn't understand when I whine that I want to move. He would rather move in the mountains in a log cabin, and I want a cottage by water. And it doesn't need to be like the ocean. I would like to move like at a harbor. Like, you know how Maine has harbors? I would be thrilled with that. But I'm also the type that doesn't like a lot of noise, and I'm not used to neighbors. I have neighbors, we all mind our own business and nobody visits each other. So I'm also used to that. <laughs> okay, Deborah, talk to you later. You take care. No, Rose, I don't expect you guys to do that. Oh, Laverne lived on Lake Erie for 40, see, I'm not that far from Lake Erie. It's only like an hour away from me. Yeah, it's not that far. I'm right. Lake, we're Lake Erie and Lake Ontario meet. That's right about where I am. Bye, Diamond Lady. Yeah, we're we're on here for another 30 minutes and then we'll be gone. So, yeah, I I think I just need a change of scenery. And even if I just got away for a week and rented a house, like on a, a cottage or something on the lake by water, I would be happy. It doesn't take much to make me happy. I can take some of my crafts with me and my Kindle. And as long as they have internet there, I'm good to go. You wish you knew. Oh, yeah. You wish you knew me then. See, I like meeting people. It's just sometimes the traveling. Unless it's local, then I'm usually okay. 
Yeah, because I drove myself all the way to Ottawa in Canada. It was a six-hour trip. I did that all by myself. No one was with me. I was fine. This is something new for me with the anxiety. I don't like it at all. And I do take an anxiety medicine, but for some anxiety, it does not touch it. So, and sometimes like one time I was sitting, a couple of weeks ago, I was sitting here and I got it and I don't know why it just hit me and it was gone within a couple minutes. But yeah, I don't like it. People, those of you that have had anxiety all your life, mm, I don't know how I, I, I hate it. Absolutely hate it. Thank you, Ms. Rad. You take care of yourself. You used to live in Wisconsin? Cool. No, Silver, I was already talking to, to, to you guys about that. I still have to get everything all sorted out. And I had wanted, every time I go to do that, I get pulled away from it. And, um... When I have days like today, I have no energy. I can't do it. It's too, um, it's overwhelming when I have days like today. Oh, you weren't far from Buffalo? See, I'm not that far from Buffalo. I'm like 45 minutes. So, hi, Rebecca. How are you today? So yeah, like I said, I am not used to this. I am I am the type that likes to I used to love to drive and um travel. I didn't like to drive far and I but Ottawa I did really good I was all on my own it was pretty much all country driving there was no city driving and when I drove to Pennsylvania when my one son lived there for school um his girlfriend at the time always went with me or I rode with my husband and that was I was fine then too so this is all new for me and I don't like it at all <laughs> your diamond painting too rose says come visit it's gorgeous here in june and july i would i would love to go to alaska it's the traveling Once I got there, I'd be good. <laughs> Mystical says, come to New Jersey. Oh, no, don't want to go to New Jersey. Been around New Jersey people. <laughs> was not a good experience. I did meet quite a few that Dylan, Dylan lived by Philadelphia. And a lot of his classmates came from New Jersey, and he made a lot of great friends from New Jersey. And two of the two of the guys came here for a weekend. So, um, but I've had a few friends that moved to New Jersey and they were treated horribly. They did not have a good experience. But no, my son loved it there. When he would, his friends from New Jersey would invite him to their homes for the weekend. And he, he loved being out there. I'm just picking on you. <laughs> I'm just picking on you. <laughs> no, it's just some of the people that that are um, we had bad experience with, but it, I know it doesn't have to do with the state. I'm just picking. 
I'm just picking like people pick on me. <laughs> no, I my son um when he was living by New Jersey, we went through New Jersey. And what is, I've been at the big aquarium that's outside of Philly and it's set, I guess it's in New Jersey. We went there and I absolutely, that's my favorite aquarium out of all the aquariums I have ever been to. <laughs> Crystal, she agrees. He's a pain in the butt. <laughs> No, I was just picking. Um, yeah, I can't remember uh, what part of New Jersey we were in. And it's right like the border of Pennsylvania. And there's a big aquarium. And I can't remember the name of the aquarium. And I loved that. I want to go back. Oh, you've been there? Yeah, I can't remember the name of the aquarium. Oh, no, don't leave. <laughs> I was just picking. I get picked on from being in New York. I was just picking. Yeah, what is the aquarium? <clears throat> right, I know. <laughs> Crystal said hubby's just shaking his head. How to win friends and influence people. I'm sorry. I was just picking. I get picked on all the time. Camden, New Jersey. Yep. Adventure Aquarium. Adventure Aquarium. That's where we went. I loved it. Oh, my gosh. That's the best aquarium I've ever been in. Yep. <laughs> you tell your hubby I love him anyways, Crystal. Don't be sending me hate mail. <laughs> so, yep, I've been to the aquarium. I've been to the aquarium in North Carolina. Um... At the Outer Banks. I was at the aquarium in Myrtle Beach. There, it's at Broadway at the beach. And I don't, is it still there? I think, I think it's still there. That one's Ripley's. Um, the aquarium in Niagara Falls sucks. <laughs> That's the worst one I've been in. The one on the on the 
United States side. I don't know if there's one on the Canadian side. <laughs> yeah, see, he's going to bring up the Yankees. See, see, Crystal. <laughs> Well, tell him I don't live in New York City, though. I'm all the way on the other side of the state. <laughs> See, that's what I mean. We get picked on. <laughs> you used to go every summer. <laughs> <laughs> See, Crystal? I can't pick on them, but they can pick on us. See, there you go. You can wait. I let you out before I went live. You're fine. So what is everybody else doing for the rest of tonight? I'm going to finish my book and I'm going to watch um, Station 19 and Grey's Anatomy. And then tomorrow I will watch um, Walker that's on tonight in Legacies, which is on tonight. Okay. And I'm going to just continue diamond painting on this because I want this done by the end of the month. And I'm almost halfway done. He's used to being picked on. He is the sarcastic king. <laughs> okay. Go, gonna watch Stephanie. Oh, okay, Crystal. Yep. Wolf paint. Wolf. Wolf pack. Hi, Jama. How are you? Ooh, chicken enchiladas. That sounds good, Rose. That sounds really good. I was thinking about chicken enchiladas the other day. I haven't had any in a long time. It's your birthday. So happy birthday to Rose. Your last year before the big 5-0. See, I didn't mind when I turned 40. I hated it when I turned 50. I really did. I don't know why. I just did. Turning 40 was no big deal for me. But turning 40 was just, I didn't want to. I know it's inevitable and it's just a number, but I didn't want to. Now it's like way over the hill and <laughs> gone out of sight. <laughs> yep, that that five O's way gone. Mystical says she's forty. See, I didn't mind that. I had a 40th birthday party. 
Didn't bother me at all. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about that one either, Rebecca. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, I found another Y. I'm dreading 50. It just seems in my head like it's so old. <laughs> yeah. Something about that 5 0. So Caroline's turning 45 in May. Your mom rented a movie theater? Wow, that's cool. See, Rose thought you were in your early 50s, Rebecca. You're going to have to put a deposit down on your walker. <laughs> yeah. Now you sound like my husband. <laughs> the, the rate that I've been going. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I got almost this whole row done today. I'm moving right along on this. I was supposed to cross stitch today, but I didn't have the energy to do that. And if I don't feel like it, I will end up screwing up and then have to take everything all out. So I'm like, forget it. I'm just going to diamond paint. So I'm sure my husband will be calling me at 7.10 like he always does. I did tell him yesterday, I texted him while he was at work. I said, don't call me at 7 o'clock like you always do. I will be in Rebecca's live stream. And you know what he said to me? He texted me back saying, well, la-dee-da. <laughs> Like, what do you mean, la dee da Crystal doesn't have birthdays. <laughs> you can't get an appointment, but hubby did. That will have to work. Really, Crystal? Why couldn't you get an appointment? I don't need that one. I don't need that. <laughs> it 
telling me wishes he was in my live stream. <laughs> I will tell him that. He's talked in the background in mine, but... No, oh, he's actually been in some of mine, hasn't he? Because he scares people because he, he would stand in the doorway behind me if I had the camera on me. He would stand in the doorway and scare people. <laughs> really, Crystal? This stinks. So, Crystal, my new planner will be here. I thought I think it said next Wednesday. I think that's what it said. Um, look. No, Monday. It'll be here Monday. So then I have to find out. <laughs> Crystal. Crystal gave up on birthdays due to lack of interest. I'm not interested. <laughs> Rose. <laughs> yeah, okay. You guys are funny. <laughs> so tomorrow I color. And I, I want to finish that Alice picture. But it's a two-page spread. So... I probably won't get it finished. But I have all year because that can count for Rebecca's year lawn Alice salon, where my my Alice salon ends the end of this month. Rebecca's is for the whole year. So I can keep coloring on that Alice for the rest of the year and finish it later on. And if I feel like this tomorrow, I don't know if I'll be coloring tomorrow. Because I don't feel like it. If I don't feel like it, I'm not going to. <laughs> oh. You still want to see the Mickey stickers? Well... I will show them in, um, do you watch my morning streams? I thought I showed them in this morning stream. Maybe not. They're okay. At what They weren't what I thought they would be. It's Mickey, but it's Mickey's Roadsters. But that's okay because... I'm not going to really decorate a lot in it, but it is the Mickey Mouse mini, mini planner. So I just wanted Mickey Mouse stickers. So I wasn't going to be real picky. Oh, okay. You can save it till the next time you come on. Yeah, I can do that, Rebecca. I'll work on that picture the same next time. A color on it then. Crystal, I when do we do your live stream? I can show your stickers then too too. Blah blah blah. I can't speak today. But I'm going to say goodbye. It is seven o'clock. Maybe I'll have soup for dinner. I want something I can cook up real quick. I don't feel like cooking. So thank you all for coming in. This was fun. I know you had to put up with my kind of mood I'm in. And 
And no, I don't have anything against anybody in New Jersey at all. I was just picking. Don't take it personally. I get picked on for being a Yankee, so I was just picking. <laughs> I love you guys. So you all have a great night. Take care. Stay safe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.